Bocca Bacchiata, Kiss Mouth, 1859, where he painted Fanny Cornforth as a robust Renaissance courtesan. The work was a stunner in the opinion of Algernon Swinburne. Bocca Bacchiata was nominally inspired by the work of the medieval poet Boccaccio. Rossetti fills the frame with his images of women, the head and the shoulder. If there's anything in the background, it's close packed. So they're crowding in on you, as you would see almost a, a face in a dream. Dante Gabriel Rossetti, painter and poet, was born on the 12th of May, 1828, in London, and attended King's College School between 1837 and 1841, showing no particular aptitude for either literature or painting. He joined Henry Sass's Drawing Academy at Bloomsbury Street in 1841 and attended irregularly until 1845, whilst adopting a bohemian lifestyle. Dante Gabriel Rossetti is one of the preeminent British Victorian painters. Uh, his work of four decades epitomizes what most people think of as the quintessential romantic uh, female heroine of the 19th century. Quite apart from the menagerie, Rossetti shared his home with a bunch of arty, unorthodox lodgers. There were rumours about the poet Algernon Swinburne and the painter Simeon Solomon sliding naked down the banisters. Again, you simply wouldn't want to be the cleaner. There were tales of Rossetti angrily hurling a cup of scalding tea in the face of the writer George Meredith, about impromptu parties, all-night drinking, nocturnal poetry readings and Rossetti's addiction to the powerful sedative chloral hydrate. Mortal love became love immortal in the art of Dante Gabriel Rossetti. His was a world of the imagination, of Christian legend, and the poetry of Dante. And he conjured up a vision of medieval romance, a dream of the past, which gave a wholly different dimension to the original Pre-Raphaelite idea. <laughs> 